The findings of another investigation into the Uvalde school shooting are set to be released to the public. Natalie Haddad has been following this story closely since the shooting two years ago. What do we know about what report is coming out today? Well, Kara, today's investigation results will surround the nearly 150 Border Patrol agents who responded to the scene of the Robb Elementary School shooting in Uvalde. What we know from past investigations is that initial officers on scene called for agents' help because they had more firepower and protection. 19 students and two teachers were killed in that May 2022 shooting. Sources who were briefed on the upcoming report say it will be about 2,000 pages long and it will be released to the public today. The sources say they had not seen the full report just yet. Now the latest in now this is just the latest investigation rather into the shooting. There have been multiple, but some of the more recent ones involved former Uvalde CISD police chief Pete Arredondo. In June, Arredondo was indicted by a grand jury on 10 counts of felony child endangerment and abandonment charges. Then in January, the Justice Department released a scathing report after it found critical failures before, during, and after the shooting. The report said the Uvalde School District was woefully unprepared for a school shooting event. But circling back to today's investigative report involving Border Patrol, we do not know what specifics to expect in this 2,000-page report. But Mark and Kara, after two years following this story, I do suspect we may see things surrounding their response time to the scene and how they breached the door to the classroom that the shooter was in. Kara. It's amazing we're still learning new things after all this time. Thank you so much, Natalie.